What's up, ladies and gentlemen? Your SoCal Storm Chaser music artist, MC Ed, is back with a brand new video. So check this out. I ended up staying another night here in Arizona because the storms got pretty good last night. But at the same time, it was a big bummer because one, I couldn't take pictures of lightning and there was plenty of lightning. However, there wasn't that many cloud to ground. And also, I forgot my tripod at my house. So how can I take pictures of lightning without my tripod? But I got a lot of videos of it in this video. So with no further ado, let's dig in right into today's video. But before I do so, you guys liking the vibe, make sure you guys smash that like button, turn on that post notification so you guys won't miss any future videos that I upload, including the storm chasing, the music, the fitness, and the vlogging and all that good stuff. And most importantly, if you guys are new to my channel, you guys never seen my face, make sure you guys smash that subscribe button. And now let's dig in right into today's video. Driving in downtown Flagstaff, Thunderclouds that are going up right now. Some nice thunderclouds going up right there. You see that? I'm posted right here watching this thundercloud move. say 100% with confidence is that there's a lot of rain and a lot of wind out here but not so much in the term of lightning again there's a lot of rain but not much of lightning like the one you saw right now it's here and there mostly but the big story is the wind and the torrential rainfall that's happening over here some traders are pulling over because of torrential rain but that's the big story out here, it's this rain that is just so heavy and I'm driving like 40 miles an hour on this freeway. I don't know how you say this to just ram through, but this rain is just heavy. Look at this storm. This is the big story. The amount of rain that's falling right now and the wind that is taking place from this big storm. Not a lot of lightning. Not a lot of it. Very disappointed. Really wanted to capture lightning on camera and on my phone, but I can't even cap lightning on my camera because I forgot my tripod on my house. But getting some flashes here and there. Again, the big story is the amount of rain that's falling and the high winds with this storm. Not a lot of lightning associated with this storm. I'm gonna turn back right here because I don't wanna get caught in the flash flooding that this storm may likely produce so i'm heading back to the hotel room right now just got the notification from the national weather service that a flash flood warning has been issued for this storm and of course just looking at this torrential rainfall flash flooding is imminent especially if these storms are hanging around here for more than 20 to 30 minutes that's more than enough time for flash flooding to begin so i'm trying to get out of this storm as quick as i can but I'm starting to feel as I drive on the highway that some parts of the highway is already flooded. So I gotta be extra cautious as I drive back. Slowly coming out of that storm cell. Not a lot of lightning again, but I'm still driving cautious as I head back to the hotel room. I'm happy to say that I'm out of that storm and now I'm speeding up a little bit because it's a little drier over here, but still driving with a little cautious and I'm starting to see a bit more lightning. So I might post up closer to my hotel room.
All right, guys, so I'm gonna wrap up the video right here because the lightning show started to fizzle out. There wasn't that much lightning anymore, but the rain was crazy. So that's it for this video. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll see you guys in my next storm chasing video. Peace.